Hey guys, welcome. I'm Jen Frost with Faith and Fabric, and here are your three quick takes for this very first week here of October. Your first quick take is that we have patterns in print. So these are not your traditional patterns in print that you are probably used to. Usually when you purchase your patterns in print from a quilt shop, they come in those nice little clear velo bags and they're folded in half. Now we do have some of our patterns um, in quilt shops. I'll put a link up here to the ones that I know about. Um, a lot of my patterns are actually sold through a distributor in print and so they, they just get sent out. So this is not a complete list of stockists, but it's at least a partial list. The way that I can get some of these patterns to you in print though is I have partnered with Amazon and a lot of these patterns now are available um, on demand to print out. So you'll see, for example, you know, we've got um, the birdhouses, we've got the little Christmas kit, we've got God Bless America, um, we've got two of our more popular ones, we've got the, um, the one we actually just finished our quilt along for, right, the Good Friday one, we've got a little one here for Christmas, this is the Silent Night, we've got our Thanks and Praise, and then we do have the full Our Jesse Tree book. So I wanted to just show you very briefly a little bit about these patterns in print so you know if you purchase one what you're getting. So when you order your pattern in print from Amazon, and again, there's a link to all the, if, if the pattern is available in print, there is a link to it in the pattern description itself. Um, not all the patterns are available in print. For example, those that are paper pieced, like our Jesse tree. Oh my gosh, you guys, there's way too many pages to try to print that out. It would be like hundreds of dollars for me to get these um, created because the, the books themselves are actually pretty pricey. Um, you'll see the sale price is almost what it's costing me, but I know this is something you guys wanted to be able to get because it's just a lot of work for me to be able to constantly be shipping one of patterns off one by one. Um, this is hopefully a good alternative. So I wanna show you the inside of this. So let's take a closer look. So you'll see first off, this is printing at an eight and a half by 11. This is a standard sheet. You've got this nice high gloss cover on the front. You've got a nice high gloss cover on the back and there will always be a picture of the quilt on the front and the back, for example, here. So you can kind of see some different views of the quilts themselves. Um, you know, just because obviously it's nice to have some beautiful photos so you know what you're making along the way. Um, the inside, however, of these are printed in black and white. So you'll see it's all black and white, which does make it a little harder to see what all these colors are. Now I'm pointing that out here because if you purchase one of these, you can always email me a copy of your receipt from Amazon and I will send you a digital copy so you can have it at least on your screen for, um, for reference to take a look at if you want to compare, but I know a lot of folks don't have access to a printer and so you can get a copy of it here and then be able to take any notes you want from, from, from there. So you'll see if I just flip through this, here's all of the instructions that are on here and you'll be able to get a good feel for what you're actually purchasing. Your second quick take is we have some new panels in the shop. You guys, I'm really excited about these. So again, we're just trying to test out some new products that you guys have been asking for. You know, our kiss was obviously the first one. So now these are not kits. Um, these are just products that I think are really cool that I would love to share with you. So the first one are these bread bag panels. So you'll see this says, give us this day our daily bread. And this is printed on a linen cotton canvas. And so this panel comes actually in a set of four, which means you can turn these into simple napkins for your family. You can turn them into those beautiful wall hangings that go in kitchens. You can turn them into little hot pads for your trivets. Um, I think these are going to be really fun addition to a lot of kitchens and especially with Christmas coming up, um, having four of them to make, you know, it's really easy to do a repetitive thing over and over so you can make four different things. You can get four gifts out of the way by turning this into something fun. Here's a little image I made of some napkins. I took my set of four and all I did was just surge the edges and I turned them into, you know, washable napkins. And because they're that linen cotton canvas, you can hear it. They're, they're a nice sturdy fabric. So um, these are available in the shop. I will put a link down below so you can find these. Again, um, all of the, these two things I'm gonna show you today are all in limited number just because I kind of want to see what the interest is, okay? So that's number one. The second item I have to share with you, um, I'm gonna put a picture right here because it's kind of hard to see this from a top-down view, but this is a three-piece panel. So it starts off, um, the Lord is my shepherd, and then it has the I shall not want right below it, and then it has, I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. And this is from Psalm 23. So this is really beautiful too. This comes with one yard of black fabric and it comes with um, a full, you know, a full uh, with a fabric, but you've got 13 inches here. Um, this way, I'll put the measurements down below. And this is actually not, not a full with a fabric. So you'll see 
Um, the measurements are down below if you click over, but this is a beautiful accent fabric. So everything here is black and white. I'll bring this nice and close so you can see it. Um, I think this would be really beautiful. It has a very modern look to it because everything right now is that black and white farmhouse. So, you know, you can take these panels, you can kind of stack them. Let me see if I can do this and have them hold <laughs> while I lift up the fabric here. So you can stack them. You can use this as a trim. You know, you can put them on an angle as you would sew them. This would be a beautiful piecing for a small quilt, for a larger quilt, or even just a wall hanging. So um, again, there's a link to this. Uh, I don't want to get, I don't want to call it a kit because there's not a pattern, but to these pre-cuts in the shop below. And your third quick update is I got a new internship and I am so excited. I'm working at a local farm one day a week for six hours while my son is in school to learn regenerative farming. And this is just such a dream. You guys, it's so funny. I used to work in the corporate world. Um, I loved what I did. I was an IT project manager. I did global implementations for software. And I was good at what I did, but it was amazing how hard it was just on my on my marriage, on my health, everything else. So, um, you know, now that I'm kind of looking at that horizon of going back to, you know, just getting out in the world. I'll always have faith in fabric, don't worry. Um, but just, you know, to get out of the house and, you know, engage a little bit more with the community. Um, I'm giving farming a try. So this has been super exciting. The farm is absolutely gorgeous. They're a farm that really practices regenerative farming, sustainable farming. The soil here is amazing. There are just worms everywhere. It is just such a viable living soil. And so I've spent the day uh, planting all of the fall crops here in San Diego. We can almost plant year round. So I'm getting some arugula in the ground that was started. I'm learning a lot about the different types of fertilizers, learning a lot about how to do irrigation for starters. So it's been a lot of fun. So there you go. Three quick takes for the week and we will see you guys in two weeks. Take care.